Ooh, and what else is in this bag? Moldy, de moldy bagels. Wow, Jesus Christ. This is disgusting. Wow. Okay, well, this is part of me cleaning up my life, so it's a part of the process. Welcome to the first episode of This Old Car, aka Dirtiest Car in America, aka My Depression Car. Welcome, welcome to This Old Car. Alright, so, went to uh, help my, some church members move, and I came after work, and when I pulled up, everybody was gone, and apparently they sent me a message on WhatsApp, like, oh, we're done, we're about to go to the storage unit, but I didn't see it, because I was driving. So, yeah, drove an hour out here. <sighs> Not for nothing. Because it's all about community, right? But, yeah, an hour. So this is what I decided to do instead. I'm about to clean out my dirtiest car. Look at all this. Okay, so that cup, that cup was here from last night. I went to a party and I was drinking, and I was drinking the drink, the juice as I walked out. And this is from this afternoon. I was literally just drinking this. So, not that it makes any difference at all. But get a child. This is a symptom of my. Hoarding habits. This is my birthday. Yeah. I'm keeping food in my car as well, but that's for like another completely different reason, which will be explained. Yeah, this is my dirty car. This is the other side, and of course, I'm going to, um, you know, take it to the car wash. But until then, I'll be posted up right here. Rain, sleep, hail, snow. Okay. Until then, I'm just had to clean it out with a with a bag. I was going to have my sister help me record this video. It, but because she's not here, and I'm not finna keep it like this for no long period of time. I'm just gonna do it right now. Cause this is also a part of that consistency, you know, like consistently keeping your, you know, stuff clean. The things God blessed you with. He blessed you with a car, you know? Keep that car clean. I'll be eating here like a mother. Oh my goodness. I really do. I eat in here a lot. Like, I'm pretty disorganized, so I do like keep some food in here because I'll forget food at home and just like have nothing so I keep food in here so that I don't get hungry so that's all you know I'm tired already ain't made if not a dent in progress but tired already it's so cool Jesus Christ okay to the back seat I go this is hard to do with one hand if I had two hands I'd probably be better off. Like this, I you know I don't be in here cleaning that off thing because yeah. Because if I did, I wouldn't be so tired so fast. Okay, the receipt's gotta stay until I can like go. Now to the back seat. Ugh. Honestly, you can kind of tell like when your room is dirty and like your car is dirty and stuff. I think also you'll realize like you have the same. Oh, I didn't realize I had these. You have the same. You didn't realize I had all these bagels. You realize you have like the same issue in the one place that you have the other. Like, yeah, this is dirty, but like you may have the same things. Like you said, there's like tissue and stuff everywhere. There's tissue and stuff. 
in my room. There's tissue and stuff in my room. So, like, that's a return theme. I keep paper towels in here. And I like the water bottles. Like, that's the same thing that dirties my room. So, yes, that's another thing that dirties up my room. I'm like, wow. Same, uh, same issue both places. But I think I'm just going to continue to clean and then I'm going to show you that after. Shell, some old chips in a bag. My God. Wow, I found my flat iron in a bag with random stuff, probably from work, and an apple that has not gone bad, which is really weird. I didn't throw it out. Ooh, and what else is in this bag? Moldy, de moldy bagels. Wow, Jesus Christ. This is disgusting. Wow. Okay, well, this is part of me cleaning up my life, so it's a part of the process. So this is what it looks like now. Not great, but it definitely needs like um, me to vacuum it professionally, but um, at least it's not as dirty. I think the back looks a lot better too. I mean, it's not perfect, but like I said, I need to go get it professionally cleaned out. The bag of trash that came out of my car. Look how big it is. Oh, and it's very heavy too, because some of the water bottles still have water in them. 